Welcome to my channel. In this video, part two of implementing statistical machine translation, we will go through implementing and building the ERSTLM package. The first step is to download ERSTLM compressed file from source 4. We will refer to the version 5.80.08. Once downloaded, we transfer the file, the compressed file, to the server and under the SMT folder, we run the command tar to decompress all files of the compressed packages. Also, we can create a new folder under SMT folder called ERSTLM, where we will put all our binary files after compilation. To create the folder, we can use the command mkdir. Once done, just to enter to the RSTLM 5.8 folder and after that we enter to the folder trunk and we regenerate make files through running the command dot slash regenerate make files dot shash. Once completed, we run the configure script by adding to the configure command dash prefix and the location of RSTLM binaries files. The previous two steps doesn't take too much time and they can finish in just uh, 10 seconds. After that, we run the command make install. And here, if we are a new build to operating system 16.04 or above, so we will, will receive an error. So we cannot run the command make install. And here, to uh, solve the problem, and uh, we can just downgrade the gcc compiler and g++ compiler so here just to enter to the file etc apt source.list and we embed two new repository server once abandoned using vi editor we go back to our command line console and we update our repository packages through the command sudo apt update once completed we just install the GCC 4.9 and G++ 4.9 After installing the GCC and G++ we can check the default compiler version through the command GCC-V and here, for sure, if we are on the Ruben 2.19, so GCC version, it will be uh, 9 or 8, and which is above 4.9. So we can also check if there is any alternative uh, GCC view, uh, compiler. And in this case, we don't have any other alternative. So here, I recommend also to install the GCC 4.8 and G++ 4.8 in addition to the 4.9 version and here to avoid any kind of issues or bugs that we can uh, face during the compilation process. After that, one of the most important thing is to change the GCC compiler, the default GCC compiler to 4.8 through the following command sudo update alternatives dash install user being G++ and G++ and the same for GCC. Once we finish, we just confirm all these changes by putting the GCC and G++ 4.8 as the default GCC compiler. Once completed, we can just clear our console using the command clear and we run the command make install and at this stage once the make install complete we are at the end of this video and we can check if all our binaries file are generated under the folder erstlm under smt
Thanks for watching part 2 of statistical machine translation tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to TechCarot channel. See you in the next video. Bye.